everyone, Scott Goldbaum here. Now in this video, we're looking at the new models and the Fender Acoustic Ampline. Featured, packed, portable, great new look, incredible sound. We surveyed a wide range of acoustic guitarists to find out what they really wanted in an amp. And the response was near unanimous. Light and loud, as portable as possible, great natural guitar reproduction, vocal mic fidelity, and a selection of tasteful effects. And it needs to be simple to understand. Now we have three amps in this line, the Acoustic Junior, the Junior Go, and the SFX2. They all have two channels designed for instrument or microphone use, each with a selection of studio quality effects for adding that nice ear candy to sweeten your playing when needed. Other convenient features include Bluetooth wireless audio streaming for jamming with tracks or playing music, and an onboard looper perfect for solo shows or just for having some fun at home. And with that said, let's hear some more tones. I have a Fender New Porter Special, and I'm plugged into the Acoustic Junior, and we're taking a mix of the stereo XLR outs and a mic in front of the amp, but favoring the DI. Now, all three amps feature reverb, delay, chorus, and vibratone, with combinations of delay and reverb and delay and chorus. There's no need to carry extra effects with you. It's all on board and ready to go. Now each channel has volume, low EQ, mid EQ, high EQ, effects level, effects select, and a phase switch to help reduce feedback. We've also got two XLR line outputs to use for recording or going direct into the PA for live performances. Plus stereo headphone output, USB jack for recording, looper with record, dub, play, stop, and undo buttons. You can also use an optional Fender four button foot switch for effects select, looper control, tap and tuner, which we'll touch upon a little later. The amps feature brown textured vinyl covering and brown woven grill cloth with embroidered logo, and it's really incredible how light these amps are. I've never seen anything like it. Now, output-wise, the Acoustic Junior and Junior Go are 100 watts, and the SFX2 features 100 watts per side in stereo. I'll mention that the Junior models also feature a tilt-back kickstand, which means you can set the amp flat on a table in cramped environments, or flip the kickstand out to project the sound upwards from the floor. So let's revisit the onboard looper. I have my MGT four foot switch and I've added the included magnetic overlay that corresponds to the amp features. Let's have some fun with more effects and create and play along with the looper. I've switched over to the Acoustic Sonic guitar. I'm gonna use a couple different tones here.
there you go, three great new Fender Acoustic Amp models, well-equipped with all the features you need for live performance, recording, writing, and rehearsing. Compact and lightweight, great new look, and three models so you can choose the one that's right for you. We touched on all of the key features, but if you have any other questions on specs, please visit Fender.com to learn more and then stay tuned for more videos. We'll see you guys next time.